it's a tragedy for the building and the owners. The Wentworth Event Center in Belfast burned to the ground early Saturday morning. According to the Belfast Fire Department, crews were called to respond to a structure fire at the center just before midnight on Friday. Upon arrival, firefighters say the fire was fully involved with heavy smoke conditions. Investigation revealed fire heavy in the back portion of the building. Uh, it wasn't shortly after we arrived and the fire had breached the roof. Um, from there, it, uh, it consumed the whole building. Firefighters say the center is a total loss. In addition to being a venue for weddings, outdoor events, and other celebrations, the building was also a site for the public transportation services provided by Waldo Community Action Partners, a nonprofit that assists low-income individuals. Firefighters say that none of the vehicles stored at the site were damaged, and Waldo CAP representatives say that services will continue. This is a little shocking. We haven't um, fully planned for something as an event as big as this, but our contingencies are in play, and we are continuing services today. Once once we can settle the next few days, we'll be able to put a longer range plan in place. Firefighters say it took nearly four hours to put out the fire. Morrill, Belmont, Searsport, Northport and Stockton Springs Fire Departments responded as mutual aid. Nearby Belfast residents shared what they saw. First of all, I think it's an utter shame. I actually live up the street and the, the lights from the fire truck had woken me up. My partner yelled, Wentworth Center's on fire, got out of bed and looked through the window and it was, the flames were above the trees. I mean, it was scary. Belfast Mayor Eric Sanders stopped by the scene to show his support. A Waldo cap is, uh, provides a tremendous uh, asset to our city. As a community, we'll, we'll get stronger. And uh, again, we're here to coordinate and offer support. Firefighters say no injuries were reported. The cause of the fire is under investigation by the state fire marshal's office. In Belfast, David Ledford, ABC 7 and Fox 22 News.